hey y'all what's up what's good what's going on everybody it's your girl and i'm back with an updated tutorial so today guys i'm pretty much just going to teach you how to cut crease cutting crease is a very simple eyeshadow technique but i do realize that a lot of persons still don't know how to do it so in this video i'm going to show you how to cut crease stay tuned guys also if you would like to see how i create this beautiful look with my eyeshadow palette stay tuned <laughs> welcome back to my channel guys if you're new here hello thank you for stopping by also don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you get off <laughs> all right so guys today i'm pretty much just going to be teaching you a simple little technique that a lot of us still don't know how to do and that is to cut crease in order to do that you're going to need your makeup brushes and you're going to need a eyeshadow palette and uh concealer my eyeshadow palette that i'm going to be using today is the warrior 3 by juvia's and this is what the inside looks like so without further ado guys let's get it started okay so here we go So I'm starting out with purple and I'm just going to take that purple and work for the corner of my eyes. So. So, you should have something looking like this. And on top of that purple, I am going in with a little orangish, deep orangish tone. It's actually called Jarawa. And that's what it looks like. So I'm going to take this brush that already had some orange on it and I'm going to take out a little and I'm sweeping it right on top like here. Okay, so guys, now that that's out of the way, I'm going to go ahead now and cut. Okay guys, so right now I'm going to go in with concealer and for my concealer today, I'm going to be using Y225 from Makeup Forever. I'm using like, this is the one. This one. So it's Y225. So I just added a little on my hand and I'm putting it on the brush now so that I can cut the crease. 
okay guys so i did this one off camera and now i'm going to do this one to show you how i actually get it to look like this all right so i do have some of the concealer on my hand here and i'm going to use my angled brush to do the work so i'm taking a little on the brush and what i'm going to do is i'm going to tap it right on my eyelid like this and then i'm going to look up and look down you realize that it actually makes a different mark from what i touched or from where i touched so where the mark is that's where the crease is supposed to stop so i'm, I'm just going to join it and show you what i mean If I should look up again and look down it doesn't go anywhere so that's where the crease is supposed to be so just watch and I'll show you Guys, you want to take your time with this part, especially if you are new to this. You want to take your time with it because you can create a whole mess with it. And it might frustrate you if you're doing it and you realize that it's not coming together. So you want to take your time with it. I'm raising my crease so that it can actually match this one. This one has been, well, it's a little bit higher, so I'm just raising this one to match it so I can have it looking new. So it actually looks the same now our close. Like so. So that's what you want to have it looking like. And then now you are going to decide the colors that you are going to be using on the crease. You can actually like add white to it or any other shade that you would like. Or you can just like give it one shade right across and just let it be like that. But me, I'm going to be using I think three or uh, two other colors to match with it or three. Okay, so I already have purple out on the end right here. And I'm just going to add a little bit more purple just to, you know, kind of this guys this section the ends so going back in with 
the purple it's called candace i'm going back in i'm just taking a little those off the excess and i'm going to just go right on the corner The purple is a part of the design that I'm doing, so I'm just going to add it on the crease that was cut. And then guys, I'm going to go in with green. green. And then this is the green that I'm using. And then for the inner section guys, I'm going to be using the yellow shade. Nzinga. Nzinga. I can never pronounce Julia's words. So that's what it looks like guys now if you are cutting your crease and you just want to use one color 
you don't have to worry you can definitely go ahead and just use one color i for some reason just decided that i wanted to use more than one color tonight so that's the reason why i had more than one so y'all have options you can pretty much do whatever color you want whatever style you want and this is what i chose i absolutely love the turn out i'm just gonna go ahead and add my eyelashes and my eyeliner off camera and then i'll show you guys the finished look but this is basically it the eyelashes and eyeliners basically and you know just clean up the excess because i didn't put a tape there so whatever is there i'm gonna need to remove it and then i'll come back and show you what it looks like all right guys so i went ahead and i put my eyelashes on and i put my eyeliner on so now this is what it actually looks like okay guys so there you have it that's how you cut a crease guys remember that you can pretty much use any color of your choice to you know give you whatever look that you would like to get i really do hope that you guys enjoy this video most importantly i hope that you guys learn how to cut a crease go ahead and shoot me your comments and let me know what you think of the video also guys let me know what you would like to see in my next video now i am going to tap out i really do hope that you enjoyed it just as much as i enjoyed making it for you that's it from me guys have yourself a wonderful evening bye everybody